It's official, no more SIM cards on iPhone. Fortunately, US Mobile has been preparing for this massive shift in the industry, and we already have a fantastically easy and friendly way to get eSIM up and running on your iPhone. First, make sure your device is compatible. Anything after an iPhone XR and XS will work. Next, download the US Mobile app from the App Store. Log into your account or create one if it's your first time. And if it is, welcome. New users will be greeted with this home screen where you can choose eSIM activation right there. If you already have lines with us, you'll go over to the Activate tab and then select Instantly Activate with eSIM. Next, we need to check for compatibility. Your phone has two IMEI codes, a digital and a physical. We're going to be using the digital one for the eSIM. Here's how to find that number in your settings to put in the field. First, open up the Settings app on your iPhone. Go down to General and tap About at the top. Scroll down to the bottom and you'll see two IMEIs here. We want to use the IMEI 2. So press and hold on that code and you'll see Copy appear. Select Copy, go back to the US Mobile app, press and hold in the field, and tap Paste. After you pasted the code, make sure you backspace any space bars in between the numbers. It should just be one consistent flow of characters. Here you have the option to get a new phone number or bring your existing phone number over to US Mobile. Both steps are very simple, but for the sake of this tutorial, I'll be creating a new phone number. Put in the zip code of where you're at or maybe where you dream you could live. And then hit continue with activation. Now it's time to pick the plan. We have plenty of resources on this on the US Mobile site and on our blog. If you don't know what plan you want, you can look there to learn more about what we have to offer. If you're already set you know what you need, you'll be able to find your plan right here. I'm going to go all in, so I'm picking unlimited all. Not only that, unlimited premium. Select continue with this plan, and you'll be met with the checkout screen. If your payment information looks good, scroll to the bottom, agree to the terms, and hit checkout. Congrats, you're almost ready to go. We just have one last quick step. There are two ways to finish the installation. On newer iPhones, you'll receive a notification that you can tap or go to your settings app and select finish setting up cellular. For older iPhones, you'll have to scan a QR code to install the eSIM. Open up another device and go to usmobile.com slash QR code. But before you go there, let me save you a few minutes. You can just scan the QR code right here. Next, grab your phone, then scan the QR code on screen. You'll see cellular plan pop up in your viewfinder. Just tap on that. Select continue and then add cellular plan. Then just wait one to five minutes and you'll eventually get a pop-up like this that says your iPhone is activated. And just to make sure, pull down from the control center and see that nice US mobile logo in the top left. One last thing before I go. I highly recommend you go into your cellular settings and turn on Wi-Fi calling. This will enable you to make and take calls and SMS text messages when you're in an office building or a parking garage or on the subway. You don't have great cellular coverage, but you have good Wi-Fi coverage. And that's it. That's how you activate eSIM on an iPhone. I have a feeling we're going to be doing that a lot more often come this fall with the iPhone 14. As always, if you have any questions, my DMs are open, and US Mobile is here for you 24-7 with our world-class customer support team to help you out. If you're running into any trouble in the app, there's always a chat box at the top right. Just tap that, ask to talk to a human, you'll be connected in a minute. Once again, I'm Anthony with US Mobile. Happy connecting!